Okay. What I will do is um, I'll try to talk about geographic coordinate system GCS and projective coordinate system PCS that are mostly used for serving and mapping purposes inside the territory of Nepal. Two of the GCS that are of our concern are Nepal Datum and WGS84 Datum. Nepal Datum is a national datum of Nepal and it uses Everest 1330 as its a reference ellipsoid. And WGS84 is a global datum and its reference ellipsoid is GRS 18. We regularly use three different projection systems as per our requirements. And the first one is the Universal Transfer Mercator Projection System, UTM system. UTM system is designed to map whole globe. And we modified the UTM system for surveying and mapping purpose in Nepal, and we call it a modified UTM system. We are using an UTM projection system since past, and nowadays there is a discussion of using Lambert conformal conic LCC projection system, either replacing uh, an UTM system to overcome the limitations of MUTM or using simultaneously with MUTM system. In Nepal, geodetic control points are based on Nepal datum. These are latitude longitude coordinates and we have converted latitude longitude coordinates into eastern northern coordinates by applying MUTM projection system. Also, uh, we have our topographic map, cadastral map, and other kinds of maps or GIS data, which has uh, adopted MUTM systems. And the GCS associated with MUTM system is by default a Nepal datum. Recently, survey department has published political and administrative map of whole Nepal, which has LCC projection system and the associated GCS for LCC is obviously a Nepal datum. Nowadays, GNSS has become a default method of surveying and surveyed data by GNSS method are in are based in WGS84 datum. Latitudes and longitudes that are based in WGS84 are converted into easting northings by applying UTM projection system. So, in context of Nepal, UTM is a link to WGS84 and LCC or MUTM is linked with Nepal datum. 